Hi and welcome back to my channel. My name is Delphine and today we are going to have a look at my Amazon purchases related to fashion and uh, my review of these articles, right? Um, so I'm gonna go through times. I have here uh, my phone and I can go through my orders and I can um, then review them. So let's get started. The last fashion related thing I bought on Amazon because we buy also a lot for the house, for the kids and everything. I think since we got kids and so on and since the pandemic also hit the COVID, we have been purchasing a lot on Amazon. Um, but yeah, the latest fashion thing I had was I ordered in the, on the 31st of May of this year, it was delivered two days after. And it was, so it's called Waterproof Dress Fabric Ribbon Double Sided Secret Body Had Adhesives Transparent, blah, 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 blah. Such a long name. <laughs> In principle, the name says it all. It's uh, double-sided adhesives for uh, for dresses and fabric, and um, that's supposed to help adhere um, some clothes to your skin. And I bought this because I have a dress which I really, really, really like, and it has this um, cross uh, shape, and um, the front tends to always get a bit too open. And I wanted just to keep it closed, you know, so to stick a bit the fabric here so that it, it, it will stay a bit more in place. And so that's what I was looking for. I was reading advice and so on. So this one has four star out of five, 59 reviews. There were not that many with a lot of reviews. Um, it was really not so easy to, to find uh, something. And I got these ones. I have a mixed opinion. It did kind of the job because it actually sticked quite good to the fabric and actually sticked quite good to my skin which was nice because a lot of these articles were either sticking good to the body or sticking good to the fabric but not necessarily sticking good to the body and the fabric um, so it was good I think it's still it's still a bit annoying to put on it's not always that easy and then um, yeah if, luckily, it, it really helps through, even through the summer. So I, I cannot say this is a bad article. This is actually, it actually worked. It's just generally, it's such, it's just annoying <laughs> to put all these little sticky things. And at the end, I ended up wearing this dress once or twice, but really I'm thinking twice before putting that dress on because I know I will have to put these little tapes or something similar and it will take forever and it's also not the most comfortable. I like really to be quite free with my clothes. And so, yeah, it works, but I don't know. I think it's just not so much for me. If you like uh, this kind of, of, of tricks and these kind of things, and you have no problem with taking a bit of time to put them on, I can definitely recommend these ones. They were really, really good. I'm gonna put all the links uh, in the description box below if you're interested, because Amazon, yes, that's also why I'm doing this video. Amazon, I got an ad, ad uh, now from them. There's some Prime Days coming with uh, nice deals and everything. And so it's the moment to start your wish list. Um, and so that's why I'm, um, I'm filming this video because Prime Days are kind of like now. So if you like one of these articles, don't hesitate to click and go have a look if you like it or not. I know personally, I like to watch these kind of videos. Um, because yeah, I find out about really cool things. I mean, this one, I found it by myself. Uh, but some of the other articles I'm probably going to mention in this video, um, I got the ID from, from watching similar videos. So that's why I'm, I'm doing this. So now I will keep going down and I will look for what was my purchase um, before that. What did I purchase related to fashion? I think there will be a time where there might be a tiny bit less. Okay. The one I ordered before was on the 20th of March 2023. And it was the magnetic chain clasp for stackable necklaces and bracelet, magnetic jewelry clasp, multi-strand, and so on and so on. And I took them in sterling silver. They also existed in gold, also a mix of gold and silver. And this is typically something I saw in another uh, video. I cannot really say which one because sometimes I see the thing and then years later I will end up buying the article. So. I'm not exactly sure what, where I saw it, unfortunately, but someone was talking about it. And these are indeed great. Um, you know, when you have these trends of having these layered necklaces and so on, 
um, it's great. It works perfectly. Um, my necklace, my jewelry stopped like getting all mixed together, which was always very annoying. And also in the morning when you don't have a lot of time and to put each one of them one after the other was always a bit uh, annoying and cumbersome. And I'm all in for something that works fast and it's easy and it's, it's, it's working great. The only downside I will say is if you have quite thin jewelry, which are then not very heavy, the weight of the clasp in the back will pull your jewelry a bit back up. You know, like for example, this necklace, it will pull it a bit back up like this. And then you might just pull again on it and have it like this, or you just might let the things like this. I mean, in principle, it's not a big deal. But I just want to notify it that you're aware of, of this um, in case you're interested in the article. And I think it's, I think they will all do that because it's just, it's just the weight of the thing, right? It's, it's physics, it's gravity, it's, it's just, just how it works. If you have more weight here in the back than you have in the front, then it's gonna pull in the back. And that's about it. If you have bigger necklaces, or maybe you have uh, things hanging from your necklaces which are a bit heavier, then I guess you will not have the issue. But just that you know, um, this could and will probably happen. Um, then now looking for my next one. I'm really buying too much things. Okay, on 28th of January, I ordered a portable steamer for, well, for my clothes, obviously, because I'm very bad at ironing. I hate ironing. Especially we don't have so many things to iron, you know, and then you have to uh, take everything out, install everything for just two pieces of clothes. And <laughs> so I thought, well, I'm going to buy a steamer because for these two or three pieces and I got this Philips uh, portable steamer. It has really good reviews, 6,600 people, 4.2. I think it, it's quite fair. I was also reading a bit in the detail what people were saying. Um, <sighs> what can I say? I don't really use it. <coughs> no, well, it's still annoying. <laughs> so... So I don't know if it's because I made a mistake in buying a portable steamer because the idea was we don't have space all the time everywhere and I did not want to have a big thing hanging there and staying there all the time. So we bought the portable steamer. I thought, yeah, well, great. It will not take a lot of space. I can keep it in a little um, drawer, take it out when I need it, steam quickly, and that's it. No, no, no. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> you have to fill the water tank, obviously, first, that you have to empty each time in between. Otherwise, the water could go bad and you could... Uh, damage your steamer so sure you have to empty it and so every time you have to fill it then you have to sing then you have to plug the thing you have to wait until it gets warm then um, since I don't have this hanging thing I have to find a place where I can hang it, the thing so typically I will put it um, on one of those um, triangle shaped clothes hanging thing hang it on a door try to do it hope they don't fall they fall I have to put them back I burned myself once because, because, yeah, I am who I am. <laughs> so, again, I think the issue is not the steamer itself, it's doing its job. My clothes are very nicely uh, ironed, steamed afterwards. Um, it's actually quite fast, the process. Once you got all the rest sorted out, it actually goes quite fast. It's easy to use. The only thing is, yeah, whether it's convenient and whether when my purpose was to save time, there I'm not so convinced it did the trick. Um, so, I, yeah, I don't know if all the steamers are like that because this is the first time I was buying a steamer. So I don't know if all portable steamers are like that or if this is something specific from Philips. I know steamer is also a brand which is uh, very famous and, and a lot of people um, have things from it. They are also much more expensive. So this one yeah, currently retails for 50 euros. So it's also not the highest price point, right? But for something that I was gonna use maybe three times in a month for three pieces of clothes, I mean, so ultimately I might use it two times, actually use it. I, I don't know, I was not so sure it was worth um, going for a much more expensive price point. So that's also what I was looking for. And again, I think it, it does the trick, it's just, it's not necessarily much faster. And that's it for 2023, because we're already end of January. And then going for 2022, so I bought, what's the date, sorry, uh, on the 13th of December, 
I bought some of those table handbag, um, table top bag holder sets. And it's a set of two. They have a lot of colors. I picked silver and black. They are great. I love them. Super practical. Don't take space in, the, in, in my handbag. I can just put them and it's no problem. You know, it's these things you will uh, put on the table when you have nowhere where you can put your clothes, your bag, and you don't want to put your bag on the ground. And then you could basically hang your bag from there. And it's really great. Um, it's really great. I cannot complain. I, I have nothing to say. I just wonder why I did not buy this earlier. <laughs> I always saw them and I always thought, ah, oh, yeah, one day I have to get one. Ah, oh, it looks cool. And then, you know, you forget about it. And the next time I'm in a restaurant and looking for a place where I can put my handbag and I'm like, mm. I'm thinking, I should really buy this. I finally did it. The thing was also a lot of my bags have the option to be worn also with a strap, with a shoulder strap. So often I can at least hang them from my seat. But I got a Birkin, I got some other bags who don't have a shoulder strap, uh, not in the size I have at least. And um, yeah, then I was like, hmm, okay. And also sometimes more and more I go to places where the back is very round. And so it will not, I mean, even with a strap, it will just fall. And I don't like that. So extremely happy I got it. No complaint. I love it. I love it, I love it. <laughs> um, then, okay, this is not really fashion related. Let me have a look, what did I buy then? Again, I buy just so, so many things. It's, yeah. Okay, another one I bought, uh, it was to organize my scarves, my Hermes scarves. I mentioned it in the video where I showed you my whole collection. It's this, um, it's called uh, 23 loop wave scarf holder okay I don't have the one with the 23 loop actually I have a slightly different one oh, yeah I have the interdesign classical eight loop scarf holder um, but they also do the 23 loop version and I think you showed it to me because I hesitated between both um, I ended up taking the one with the eight loops just that I I did not want to have necessarily too many scarves on one of the things I'd rather take two and have them a bit more separated and so it has also great reviews, uh, 4.5 star out of 1,872 reviews, so it's great. I can complain, I'm very happy with it. Um, it's really great. I, I mean, my scarves are in it. I bought it on the 11th of August 2022, so it's been more than a year. And really, no complaint. It does the job. Um, it's great. If you look for something to organize your, your scarves and so on, um, it's great, especially before the winter, if you have also a bit bigger scarves, not just the tiny silk one like the Hermes ones, but if you also have wool ones or, I mean, it, no complaint, it's great. You can go for it, no, no risk there. I'm then looking for the next one. What did, what was my following purchase? Again, yeah, really, really ordering so much, um, especially for the kids. Yeah, I ordered some scrunchies. So I don't know if that really counts as fashion or, or not. I was going to a party for a friend. Uh, the team was um, 80s, the 80s. And so I wanted to do, you know, some some big uh, things like this, you know, like uh, a bit something like this around with a very colorful uh, scrunchie. And I bought this set, um, velvet scrunchies for girl, scrunchies hair, rubber bands, so on, so on. 4.4 star. 1,140 reviews, they are amazing, they are amazing, they are amazing. It was a set, I thought, oh, what will I do? So many of them, uh, what am I gonna do <laughs> with all of that? Especially since I just wanted maybe two or three for the party. But to be honest, I kept using them. I keep using them uh, because they're just great when I go for doing some sport or when I, uh, on, you know, when I wash my face and I need to tie my hair or at home, I just need to tie my hair shortly. My hairs are short, right? So I don't normally style them in a ponytail because it looks, my ponytail is looking a bit, I don't know, I will not say ridiculous, but it's, um, yeah. A bit funny <laughs> so I typically don't style them in a ponytail but sometimes very warm and sometimes you just need to tie your hair um, sport these kind of things and they they're great they're great they don't slide down um, they're not painful they don't break your hairs yeah really 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 good I was actually <laughs> positively surprised I was thinking oh okay I will never use them again uh, yeah 
it was fine because they had a good price. Um, so I was like, okay, even if I don't use them again, whatever. But actually I use them a lot. So yeah, go for it. Again, I can definitely recommend them. I have actually some clothes. I have some pyjamas. I have some flannel uh, pyjama, women's pyjama flannel. Um, so they have 80 reviews, 4.5 stars. Um, and they were um, with uh, long uh, sleeves. Um, yeah, lounge set, very nice. I took it in two colors, in this navy blue and in this dark red. They are great. They are very comfortable. Um, they are very nice. Uh, what I did, because um, I found that the little buttons look a bit cheap, so I bought other buttons and I just changed the buttons. But you don't have to. I mean, principle, it's pyjama, right? Who cares about the buttons? So I'm a bit like that. I took the time and I did it, but you don't have to. They are very comfortable. They are great. I still use them. And we are now in 20, November 2021, so almost two years ago. And I did so use them the winter of 2021, the winter of 2022, and I'm going to use them in this winter. So um, I can 100% recommend them. They are, they are great. Uh, I keep looking. <laughs> it's funny because yeah, it's a time when we got our son and it's funny going back in time because you see oh, yeah, all these babies are that when our son started walking and we had to baby proof the whole house. <laughs> it's, uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's funny like that. Um, then what do we have? I don't know. I thought I'm not seeing. I was looking for but I don't know where I have put because we ordered also. I will see if I find uh, in between the the thing. I own um, some some things for sorting, um, you know, for for organizing your drawers, um, so that you can, for example, separate your socks properly. Ah, here they are. So they are called Song Mix Storage Box for underwear, drawer, organizer, and so on, a divider for socks, bras, and ties, and so on. 4.4 star, 5,657 reviews. They exist in a lot of color. I took them in gray, but they're also in black, in beige, in pink, whatever color you, you like. Um, and they are great. They are great. They are great. They are perfect. Uh, I use them for exactly that, sorting my socks, my tights, um, my underwear and it works perfectly and my drawers are much more organized than they used to be and i'm extremely pleased with it i used to have like one big box for the things and it was always such a mess to find the things and match the things or and now it's all nicely organized um this is something i bought so we moved in november 2021 and so i bought this on the 3rd of november 2021 so it was right after we moved um you know new start you unpack your boxes and i was like this time this time i'm gonna do it right and yeah they're great they're they're really great no zero complaint um, about them uh, another thing, and I've already mentioned this one, I think in my affordable handbag uh, collection, it's a handbag organizer. And I use this to, well, you could use it for anything, just to organize your handbag generally. I personally used it to convert one of my tote bags into a diaper bag. <laughs> and it's a, yeah, it's an organizer, an insert for tote bags with handles. Um, it has 4.4 uh, stars, 1,892 reviews, and yeah, it's great, it's great. We still use it. We got a second kit in between uh, because this I bought 12th of January 2021, so I was preparing for first child. Um, it's been great. Got a second kid, still using it, still going strong. <laughs> so I can 100% um, recommend this too. And we're already in 2021. You see, I don't order that much things uh, related to fashion because, yeah, well, I want the things to be good, right? So I take time to research and so on. And at the end, I don't end up necessarily ordering so many things. And I think that will be it because now look 2022, 2020, sorry, there's not much. And I know before 2020, we were not ordering a lot on, on Amazon. But so these are what I've ordered. These are my reviews of these articles, and I hope it was helpful. Um, I will put the links in the description box below. If you also have other articles that you want to recommend, that you want to share, um, please write them down below, and it could be helpful for, for the others. And yeah, 
I will um, put here a video in case you have not seen it yet and if you have enjoyed this video and you would like to see more then you can subscribe to my channel by clicking here and I will see you in the next video guys I'm most certainly gonna do one about uh, children's things because when I see how many children's things we're ordering on Amazon I think I need to do a review of this <laughs> so bye guys